Botox, fillers, and plastic surgery have seen a boom in recent years. But as the procedures grow in popularity, some celebrities are opening up about the hardships they've experienced and the lessons they've learned in the aftermath. Having said that, these are the top 15 celebrities who regret getting plastic surgery. Let's dive in, shall we? Number one, Ariana Grande. In her Vogue Beauty Secrets tutorial posted to YouTube last year, Grande shared that she has had a ton of lip fillers over the years and Botox. But now, she wants to see herself age naturally. I stopped in 2018 because I just felt so too much. I just felt like hiding, you know, she said. For a long time, beauty was about hiding for me, and now I feel like maybe it's not. Grande added in the video that she stopped getting fillers and Botox because she wanted to see her well-earned cry lines and smile lines. I hope my smile lines get deeper and deeper and I laugh more and more. And I just think aging is like such a, it can be such a beautiful thing. Now, might I get a facelift in 10 years? Might, yeah. But these are just thoughts that I feel like we should be able to discuss if we're sitting here talking about beauty secrets, she said. Fuck it, let's lay it all out there. Number two, Kylie Jenner. In an episode of The Kardashians that aired in July, Kylie Jenner opened up about her decision to get breast implants as a teenager, saying she would be heartbroken if her daughter were to follow in her footsteps. In conversation with her friend Stassi Karanikolaou, Jenner revealed that she got the surgery done at 19, shortly before her unexpected pregnancy with her daughter, Stormy. Jenner added that she now appreciates her natural body and wished she never got them done to begin with. I have a daughter. I would be heartbroken if she wanted to get her body done at 19, Jenner said. She's the most beautiful thing ever. I want to be the best mom and the best example for her. I wish I could be her and do it all again because I wouldn't touch anything. Number three, Bella Hadid. In 2022, supermodel Bella Hadid told Vogue that she regrets the nose job she got when she was just 14. I chose the people and the judges and the panel, so that's definitely something I look at. I wish I had kept the nose of my ancestors, said Hadid, who has Palestinian roots. I think I would have grown into it. Number four. Linda Evangelista. Linda Evangelista said that she was brutally disfigured after a cool sculpting procedure. She alleged that she developed paradoxical adipose hyperplasia after the procedure, saying, the bulges are protrusions and they're hard. If I walk without a girdle in a dress, I will have chafing to the point of almost bleeding. Cool sculpting is a fat freezing procedure that is reportedly often promoted as a non-invasive alternative to liposuction. Number five, Courtney Cox. Friends star Courtney Cox opened up about her past use of filler in a 2017 interview and shared that she had since had them all dissolved. Now, as natural as I can be. The Friends star speaking about her cosmetic procedure regrets and how she's approaching aging now. Jenny Norman is here with more for it. She divulged to New Beauty that doctors would suggest she get a little injection here or filler there until she was layered and layered and layered, something she hadn't realized at the time because the procedures occurred gradually. I feel better because I look like myself. I think that I now look more like the person that I was, she said. I hope I do. Things are going to change. Everything's going to drop. I was trying to make it not drop, but that made me look fake, she added. You need movement in your face, especially if you have thin skin like I do. Those aren't wrinkles, they're smile lines. I've had to learn to embrace movement and realize that fillers are not my friend. Number six, Khloe Kardashian. While Khloe Kardashian has hailed her nose job, saying her only regret was not having it done sooner, she has expressed some disdain for fillers. Fillers did not work for me. I looked crazy, she said on the short-lived Cocktails with Chloe in 2016. Everyone gets so upset, like, why don't I talk about it? No one's ever... I went to have it all dissolved like three times, she said. Number seven, Cameron Diaz. Before Botox made its way into the mainstream, Cameron Diaz was already speaking out about her own negative experience. 
is a brutal assault on oneself. Mm. And, you know, we spend so much time comparing ourselves to other people. No Botox ever. I've tried Botox before, she told Entertainment Tonight in 2014. It changed my face in such a weird way that I was like, no, I don't want to be like that. I'd rather see my face aging than a face that doesn't belong to me at all. Number eight, Jamie Lee Curtis. Jamie Lee Curtis has shared two major concerns about plastic surgery, including a health issue she experienced firsthand. You try to work your way into a sober life and that there is hope. The current trend of fillers and procedures and this obsession with filtering and the things that we do to adjust our appearance on Zoom are wiping out generations of beauty, she told Fast Company in a 2021 interview. In 2018, the actor also opened up to people about a plastic surgery recovery process that spiraled into a decade-long opioid addiction. After going under the knife in 1989 for a minor cosmetic procedure on her hereditary puffy eyes, she was prescribed painkillers and developed a Vicodin addiction. I tried plastic surgery and it didn't work. It got me addicted to Vicodin. I'm 22 years sober now, she said. Number nine, Ashley Tisdale. In a 2020 Instagram post, Ashley Tisdale shared that she decided to have her breast implants removed due to health issues that she believed were a result of the procedure she had years before. Prior to the surgery, I constantly felt my body was less than and thought this change would make me feel more whole and more secure about myself. And for a short period of time, it did, the actor wrote. But little by little, I began struggling with minor health issues that just were not adding up. In the world, I'm known as Ashley Tisdale, which makes me feel like a good separation, but I'm excited to finally be able to let you guys get to know me as Ashley French. Food sensitivities as well as gut issues, she continued. The actor added that the journey has been one of growth, self-discovery, self-acceptance, and most importantly, self-love. Number 10, Melanie Griffith. In 2017, Melanie Griffith spoke about regretting some of the work that she had done. I didn't realize until people started saying, oh my God, what has she done? I was so hurt, she said. I went to a different doctor and he started dissolving all of this shit that this other woman doctor had put in. Hopefully, I look more normal now. <sighs> Number 11, Reed Ewing. Back in 2015, modern family actor Reed Ewing wrote an essay about his body dysmorphia and his subsequent cosmetic procedures, starting with cheek implants. He said of plastic surgery, it's a horrible hobby and it will eat away at you until you have lost all self-esteem and joy. I wish I could go back and undo all the surgeries. Now I can see that I was fine to begin with and didn't need the surgeries after all. Number 12, Aisha Curry. Aisha Curry had a rash breast augmentation after welcoming her second child, but it didn't go as planned. She showed her old breast implants on an episode of Ellen saying, they weren't good to me. Moment to have like a going away party for them because they weren't good to me. They didn't work for me. They work for some people, but they didn't work for me. They work for some people, but they've got to go. And I don't ever want to see them again. <sighs> Number 13, Crystal Hefner. Crystal Hefner said in an Instagram post, I removed everything fake from my body and deleted all my old photos. I am more authentic, vulnerable, and feel that I belong more to myself. I am mine. She previously almost died after having a fat transfer surgery and had her breast implants removed after they caused illness. <sighs> Number 14, Heidi Montag. This blonde, blue-eyed, and thirst for fame rising reality TV star rose to fame in her role as Lauren Conrad in The Hills, 2006 to 2010. However, in 2010, she underwent an astonishing 10 cosmetic surgeries in a single day. From a mini brow lift to buttock augmentation, Montag's initial goal of a few enhancements spiraled into a daunting and painful experience. Later in a TikTok, Heidi Montag said that she sometimes regrets having had plastic surgery. Speaking in 2019 about having had 10 procedures in one day when she was 23, she added, I was way too young to make such a life-changing decision. 
I wish I had waited and not made a decision so young because I have long-term health complications. <sighs> Number 15, Chrissy Teigen. Model Chrissy Teigen also opted to have her breast implants removed in 2020, noting at the time that the decision was no biggie. I'm getting my boobs out, she posted on Instagram. They've been great to me for many years, but I'm just over it, she wrote. I'd like to be able to zip a dress in my size, lay on my belly with pure comfort. In the post, Tygen added that she'll still have boobs, they'll just be pure fat, which is all a tit is in the first place. A dumb, miraculous bag of fat. And that's it for this video. Please click the like and subscribe buttons down below if you found it useful. To make sure you don't miss any uploads, tap the bell icon. Share the video and comment down your thoughts. See you in the next one.